What's going on, world? It's your boy, Big Chips. Listen, I actually had it on the uh, Class of the Rock station this morning, and uh, <laughs> it's playing Foreigner Head Games. And it just kind of made me think, although the, the song's about something else, but it made me think about things because as I look around and I see signs, like literal signs, and I read what they say, it's all determined on how I feel inside on how I'm going to take what the words are saying. And I guess it comes down to the fact of what kind of vision are you casting? What is it that you're, you're seeing in, for your future? And it all starts with the way you think. So if you are negative about everything or you have a pessimistic attitude or an attitude of lack of doubt, you know, basically, that's what you're going to get more of. I like the little ambiance back here that the sun's casting out. It's about the end because I'm turning, but it's kind of funny looking. But anyway, Squirrel, what are you thinking about? What are you putting in your head as that thought, that thing, for which controls and dictates what your life will be or become? So, when you think about the head games, it's a mental warfare, folks. It's a mental warfare. And we've been brought up to think such lack and such doubt and not enough that we can't allow ourselves to be happy, to be prosperous, to be successful. We, we actually stop ourselves. You know, and then we think about all the bad stuff that's happened to us, and oh, it's their fault, it's his fault, it's her fault, oh, it's me. And we're always quick to point the finger, but it's not until you start owning up to what you're doing, to your life, to your thing, that you actually begin to awaken. And you actually get to the point of mental clarity and to the place of victory. So today, I mean, basically, I just want you to, to start thinking the way that you want to think. Not the way that you've been brought up, not the way that of the things that have happened, not the lack, not the doubt. Start thinking of what you want. Get playful. Get playful. It's about the victories of your life and where you want to go and what you want to do and where you want to go. I mean, it's a freaking beautiful thing. And until you start getting to a point of victory and to a point of living your life for more, you're never going to have it. You can hope for something to happen all you want. You can have faith in that hope that it's going to happen. But until you believe it, until you can see it in your mind, you're not going to achieve it. So, you know, I'm casting out big visions. I'm casting out big thoughts, big things for my group, for my team, for my surroundings, for my loved ones. Because it all starts with somebody. It all starts with something. So why not you? Why not me? Why not us? That's the point. Why not? <laughs> you know? Why not? So I'm casting that vision out over what's going to happen. And I see it clearly. And I am more than certain of what it will be. And that, my friend, is what I will cast my energy out on. That's what I will sit down and think about. When I sit in a room to meditate or to think upon that which I want, it includes what is happening for my team already. So that's all it is. That's all it is. It's all about where you want to go, where you want to be, what you want to do. But you've got to think of all that which you want, not just what you've got to have. What do you want? And that's where you find your victory. All right? So it's your boy, Big Chips. Listen, got number love for you, man. Got number love. All right? Make it a great day. I dare you.